Dear students, in this topic, we shall discuss evolution and human culture. The human culture and certain social behaviors are due to expression of genes. Genes perpetuate by natural selection. So, human culture is related to Darwinian evolutionary theory. An irrational interpretation of genetic and evolutionary basis of human behavior may be misleading because it will justify the status quo in human society rationalizing social injustices and animal behavior of human. However, the human behavior has plasticity. It is not a rigid genetic model. Just as our anatomical features vary extensively, so do the inherent behaviors due to environmental effects. Just like environment intervenes in phenotypic expression of physical traits, it also affects the expression of behavioral traits. Dear students, animal behavior may not be plastic, but the human behavior is probably most plastic than any other animal, as humans have greater capacity for learning. In human, the control of instinctive behaviors is produced by certain cultural norms. Human behavior, ko jab hum plastic kehte hain, it means ke wo modify hota hai, aur modify karne ke liye humans ka jo natural ya Darwinian जो व्यू है कि जिसके मुताबिक ये जेनेटिक फैक्टर से कंट्रोल होता है लेकिन इसकी जो प्लास्टिसिटी है दैट शोस दैट इंस्टिंक्टिव बिहेवियर कैन बी कंट्रोल्ड और ह्यूमंस की जो कल्चरल हिस्ट्री है इसमें ह्यूमंस ने बहुत सारी स्ट्रक्चर्ड सोसाइटीज बनाई हैं जिनमें ह्यूमन बिहेवियर को कंट्रोल किया गया है दी स्ट्रक्चर्ड सोसाइटीज हैव लॉज गवर्नमेंट्स इंस्टीट्यूशंस कल्चरल वैल्यूज and religions. These institutions define what behavior is acceptable and what is not. Many instinctive behaviors may enhance an individual's Darwinian fitness, but they are considered unacceptable and prohibited by law. Actually, these are the social and cultural institutions which define values. And these values actually make the human behavior distinct and controlled than that of other animal societies. Animal society or human society may the difference hai, that is because of values, not because of genetics.